we're going to hear from some of our students now. I'd like to introduce Zoe Glanatsis, Cecilia Heath, and Chloe Wilkins. Please make them welcome. Good evening, everyone. I am Cecilia, one of the symphonic band leaders. I would like to start off by thanking everyone for being here tonight and for those who couldn't make it in person for joining the live stream. In year seven, my mother wanted me to play the trombone or the trumpet. I joined training band on tuba and wind ensemble on percussion. Yeah, not exactly what she wanted, but I digress. Some people would think that playing multiple instruments would be a challenge and a hard to balance. But playing multiple instruments gave me more chances to make friends with those around me. I simply just had a great time, even with us having rehearsal in the mornings. One of my favorite experiences experience with being in the band program has been the bus rides that we've taken all over the place. There was always a very high chance of at least someone trying to start a sing-along for like, any of the pieces we were playing. The bus rides just gave us a chance to talk to everyone else, a chance to make a lot of friends, and most of the friends that I currently have I made due to the band program. I have spoken to many more people than I likely would have otherwise due to needing to organize things, discussing how different parts of work, to work together, and just casual conversation. Another more recent experience I got to have was playing my part in upholding symphonic band traditions that I hope will continue for a long time to come. I won't say what it is to keep the surprise for future symphonic band students, but all I'll say is that you will have fun with what happens. Before I finish, I would like to give a huge thanks to all of our instrumental teachers for helping educate us, and also to all other music staff for helping organize everything. None of what we have done would be possible if it were not for you. It has been an absolute pleasure playing with all of the symphonic band members in the past four years, but it is time to pass the baton. I will always cherish the memories, the mates, and the music we have made together. Thank you. Good evening. I'm Zoe, and I'm one of the symphonic band leaders. From the moment we've picked up our instruments and played our first shaky notes, we became a part of the Eltham High music family. Little did I know that this program would become a pivotal part of my life, shaping not only my musical abilities, but also my character and my friendships. This program has not only given us the chance to play in large ensembles, but it has also opened doors to explore music in a variety of ways. Whether through joining jazz or stage band or pursuing VCU music, this program has equipped us all with the skills to participate in music in whichever way we desire. This program has not only challenged us all musically, encouraging, encouraging us to problem solve, to gain new perspectives, and provide us with an opportunity to collaborate with others. It has also provided us with a sense of belonging and community. Making beautiful music with these amazing people has been the highlight of my high school experience. And none of this would have been possible without the, without the dedication of our hardworking teachers and conductors. I would like to thank each and every teacher for their endless commitment, unmatched talent, and unconditional belief for all of their students to achieve their musical goals. Our music teachers have been our, men our mentors, our guides, and our biggest supporters. They've patiently taught us to read notes, to find our voices, and to interpret the language of music. To them, I extend my heartfelt gratitude for their unwavering dedication. And where would our music program be without Jane? I'd like to thank her for her constant patience and calm and friendly presence in the music department. Without her hard work behind the scenes, none of what you see here today would be possible. But we would, but we would not be here today if it weren't for the incredible talent and commitment of our conductor, Rick Keenan. Thank you for constantly challenging and encouraging us to achieve such a high standard. Thank you for constantly being there since day one. On our first day of training band, when we were only little grommets, as he would say, to today, as we stand here as legends. <laughs> and on a personal note, this marks the end of an era for my family. As we've been part of this music program since 2010, 
so we would like to thank Rick and the entire music department for their support over the past 13 years. I want to express my deep gratitude to everyone who has been a part of this incredible journey. The teachers, the fellow students, the supportive families, and the dedicated audience members who have cheered us on throughout the years. Thank you. Hey everyone, I'm Chloe, a member of Eltham High's Symphonic Band. I'd like to briefly talk to you all about some of the incredible opportunities I've had, the chance to experience during my time in the music program here at Eltham. This year, Symphonic Band worked alongside the talented Jody Blackshaw to reflect on reconciliation through music. Through a range of different workshops, we were able to get involved in the process of composing a piece that told an important and moving story through music. Although challenging, this experience will be one I hold close to me, as I too felt moved by the music that we created. I feel grateful to have had this opportunity, not only with Jody, but with all the other incredible guest conductors that have helped us grow and improve throughout our music journey. In 2022, the Symphonic Band was invited to perform at the Melbourne Recital Centre and take part in workshops with conductor Nick Williams and the Melbourne Uni professors. Their expertise and their craft offered us new skills to improve on our instruments and better understand our repertoire. An upbeat and exciting performance from University of Melbourne Wind Symphony had us grooving around on the edge of our seats. This rare opportunity to collaborate with these talented musicians brought us to the next level for the end of our year concerts. For me, music has always felt like a creative outlet and a way of expressing myself through sound. I've met some incredible people, formed close friendships, and have been a part of making some pretty unbelievable music. I'd like to encourage those in the music program to continue to persist on their instruments, even when it's challenging. It's been such a rewarding experience in the end. Once again, I'd like to say a big thank you to Rick, all the conductors, teachers, mentors, my peers, and all of the music department for continuing to support and inspire us all. Thank you. Thank you.